Hello everybody, I'm Mike with Omega Survival and Exploration, and this is my second review video in quite some time. I haven't been making videos for personal reasons on healing, and it's going to take me a little bit of time still before I can get to any kind of video where I have to do a lot of chopping or heavy field use videos, so in the meantime, I'm going to take this time to do a lot of videos that I've had to do for quite some time that are really kind of low impact on my body like a flesh light review and a couple other first aid kit reviews and things like that. This is an A-Tactical flashlight from WowTac. This is the A1 550 lumens. When I got this flashlight for review, as you can see the box says A-Tactical. The company is WowTac. Now, I'm not exactly sure where that change took place, but sometime in the last few months it took place. If you're looking, don't look up A-Tactical. You want to look up WowTac. I will leave a link in the description box below. The flashlight that I'm going to show you is 5.35 inches by an inch. It's got a very traditional tactical look and feel to it. The selector switch is on the front to change the modes of the flashlight and the on off switch is on the back grip of the flashlight. The price point on this flashlight is about $25. Um, there's other flashlights out there that are roughly the same look and feel of this light and I've had it for quite a few months that are like three or four times the price. If you're looking for something that's kind of affordable and still works good, this flashlight is. Um, I can honestly say I've used this flashlight myself now quite a bit. Somewhere between six and eight months now on a regular basis and I've had absolutely no issues with it whatsoever. It works exactly as it should. It throws out a really nice beam of light. It's rechargeable. It only weighs 85 grams. It's powered by an 18650 battery. A uh, low, it's 10 lumens and that'll last for 5.5 days. On medium, that's 63 lumens, it'll last for 19 hours. On high, it's 200 lumens and it'll last for 5.5 hours. On turbo, it's 550 lumens for 3.3 hours. And on strobe, it's also 550 lumens at four hours. It has a 205 meter beam distance it's impact resistant to 1.5 meters, so roughly 4 feet, and it's waterproof to 1 meter. When you get the package, it will look like this. It comes with spare O-rings. It does come with the charger plug, a micro USB. It comes with the clip, which is also in the box. And if anyone can't figure out how to recharge this battery, the USB, the micro USB charges in by plugging into the battery directly, which is right there. It even shows you a really big diagram on the side of the battery itself. It has a pretty decent amount of hand grip on it so if your hands get wet or sweaty I don't think you have any problem with it gripping off it's got the orange peel reflector I just want to give you a close-up before I get out side and actually show you how this performs I'm just waiting for it to get dark out right now So stick with me, and we'll get to the good stuff now that I've gotten finished explaining all the details about it. So stick with me, and we'll get outside and see what this can do. This has actually got a really good beam on turbo Ooh. if you need to search for something. It's got an incredibly good, um, very solid beam. Very clear.
And like I said, that fence down there is about 100 feet from where I'm at. So to go over things again really quick, this is low at 10 lumen, medium at 63, high at 200, turbo at 550, strobes also at 550. But needless to say, if you're going to be walking on a trail, I would say it's a really good idea to leave it on high on 200 lumen. It's more than enough to see everything you need to see and brighten the entire trail up. If you really need more exposure, then you gotta hit something down on the trail or you need to search for something up in a field. You can switch it to turbo. The 550 will give you more than enough power. Well, I'm on a simple trail though. I just leave it on high. 200 plenty. Well, everybody, I'm Mike with Omega Outdoors and Exploration. I hope you enjoyed my video. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll leave a link in the description box below to the flashlight. And until next time, thanks for watching.